Hello, Gemini. Getting ready to do your reading. Let's see what is going on at this time for you. What your messages are. You have the card of blessings. Celebration. Wow. Under the deck is meditation. Okay. So <clears throat> some of you are going to have a celebration. There's a blessing. There's something you've been waiting for, wanting, and you're going to have a celebration. Wow. All right. What is going on for Gemini? Let me pull two. Freedom and stability. Wow, so some of you could be um, receiving a new job, getting more money in, so you have more freedom to do things. Some of you are going to be uh, going on a trip. Freedom tells me travel. Again, something could be leaving your life. Yeah, basically you're gonna get more money so you can do the things you wanna do. That's nice, okay. And that's 13 and 14. Freedom from your job, freedom to do something different, freedom. So take it as a blessing and you're going to celebrate. You have more freedom. You have more stability. So what is going on for Gemini? Let me turn this way. What is going on for Gemini? Some of you are getting rid of a, a I just heard the word ridiculous. Getting rid of a boss or person who had like you chained in some way. Because I saw the devil, saw the king of coins. This could be a boss, a job, a person, something like that. I got the word like this is ridiculous. This person's ridiculous. I don't. Hmm. What is going on for Gemini, please? Yep. Overall energy could be the Three of Cups. Could be celebrating. Somebody could be looking at. You. Ooh. Well, they could have created some negative karma for themselves because they may have lied or tried to do something. Possibly Six of Wands hidden can be a challenge, but I don't think it will be a challenge. I don't think. And Page of Wands with the Ace of Swords under the deck. So this could be news that you're getting and celebrating. Someone else does not look too happy. We're going to look over at you like, why are they celebrating? Why is Gemini celebrating? I don't know if this is your seven of swords or theirs, but um, there's victory here. Some of you might be letting go of or getting rid of or leaving an earth sign or leaving a job or something like that. Also, like I already said, something could be coming in that you've been waiting for. Look at this again. There's like under the deck is sub 10 of cups. Let me slow down. I'm getting excited here because ace of wands again, like good news. Something you've been waiting for, four of coins, eight of wands, messages. What is this nine of wands person though? See, there may be an earth sign or a job or, or a person at your job or some somebody here. Let me see. Let me see if you're going toward this king of coin or leaving it though. Because I felt like you're leaving something behind. King of coin, please, one more. Okay, King of Coins and Five of Cups, but he's the Five of Cups is in reverse. So it could be a Pisces, maybe, but somebody's disappointed that you either don't want to deal with them, don't want to talk to them, you're quitting, you're leaving. This person may have been deceptive in the past. This person, this may be like karma because for treating you poorly. Like, let's just say, like, you put in a lot of hard work over the time, and now you're getting um, a reward, and they're looking over, like, why do you always get the reward? Well, maybe they have a bad attitude. Maybe they're mean to people. Maybe there's, you know, they're deceptive. I don't know. I have a feeling what I'm picking up and seeing, and we, I don't want to focus on this person, but it kind of feels like someone may be, may be jealous, maybe upset, whatever. Well, let me keep going here. I don't want to focus on the negative. Because there's an offer here. What's coming in is working together three of coins. So I don't know if the Seven of Swords is yours or theirs. Because if it's yours, it could be that you're just not telling people things. Um, you may be feeling a little proud, a little cocky possibly. But you're happy because I feel like maybe there's someone who's trying to hold you back. Be negative, be mean, whatever. They didn't want you to move on. and But you are moving on. You are celebrating something. I feel like some of you, this could be a job promotion. What is the Six of Wands in the Hidden? Well, I'm just, I, okay, this is telling me that you guys definitely have some sort of money coming in. Big money that people are going to be noticing you. Um, I feel like you have worked hard to get this. I guess some of you may be getting a nice car, like a really fancy car, and people are like staring at you and looking at you. They're jealous. Um, but Ten of Coins, people are watching you. But I feel like you've worked hard for this. You're getting you're getting something in. And it's going to give you freedom, though. And it's a blessing. And you need to celebrate this because you've been working hard for this. You're manifesting this for quite a while. Maybe, you know, four months, four years. Who knows? But you've been holding on to this. It's like, it's when you manifest something and you <clears throat> have even lost hope at some point that it's even going to happen. And then finally it happens. It's just weird that you have it. It almost looks like a specific person. It doesn't have to. It could be a group of people. 
who feel like you're lucky. Gemini, like you're lucky. Like why is Gemini so lucky is what I'm kind of picking up. Oh my gosh. Um, okay, the down, downside of this reading, it's, it's like you got a really nice message here. Four swords under the deck. It's like, I don't, I don't know if you have a specific person because I got a queen of coin here now. The king of swords could be you. But it's like people around you are arguing or they, they're not happy that, that, that you're getting this new opportunity or this money. Or you could have a falling out with somebody because of how they act. So that's the downside. But I guess that's reality. That's life. Let me look at this really quick. Yeah, I feel like there's a situation you're going to be cutting out of your life with the death card. And I felt it earlier. It's like you want to celebrate and tell people this good news. But you may not. Or maybe you're... You know, you may hold it back. You may decide not to. But then I feel like you decide, yes, I'm going to. I want, I want people to celebrate with me. I want to include everyone in this, this good news. But they end up being jealous. And Seven of Swords, maybe they're hiding resentment. Uh, or, or you invite them to come with you. And instead you find out that once they get there, they're arguing or they're putting you down or they're talking behind your back. So, so but that's just, I guess, life. I guess it's like there's this small part of this reading that's very disappointing to you but you're going to find something out is what i'm getting you're going to find out who your friends really are who really cares who doesn't care so there's going to be say again some of you you may be able to get out of a bad relationship a bad job because of this new money coming in okay um that may be what i'm seeing here maybe that's all i'm seeing and you may not tell people until the last minute you may just leave um but I get that just again blessings, blessings for you, and I feel like you want to share these blessings. I don't feel like you want to, you know, hoard them. You want to share them, but it makes makes it difficult when people really truly aren't happy for you. There might be an apology about finances, maybe here and now. There's a decision that needs to be made about acceptance. Okay. I'm kind of getting for some of you, you may go up a tier or two in your finances, like up another level or something. And again, you're going to have to make a decision because some people aren't going to accept this. If you're working in a, in a business and you get promoted to management and no one else, you know, they all look at you differently. Now they're all envious that you're now a manager and they're not, um, you don't need to apologize. I don't get some of you, there could be some sort of like apology from a company. They're going to give you an award, a large amount of money. Um, so the apology may not come from a person, but it's, but it's like the compensation is the payout that you're going to get from someone. Because I'm seeing money here huge. Yeah, it could be someone is having to pay for something they did by giving you financial support or money. And you're going to get it soon, and then you're going to have the decision about who's around you. Who's going to be there for you? Who's not envious of you? Um, like somebody may win like a jackpot, like a huge amount of money, like to the point where it shows like, it's going to show, it's going to reveal people's true feelings for you and what you need to know. And I don't get, you're going to be that upset. I don't get like, you're really that upset about it. I really don't. I get like, you're disappointed, but you're not that upset. You got enough money now. That's like, you're like, okay, well, glad I know this now. But, um, so anyways, and maybe part of it is don't don't take the focus off your blessing. Take put the focus on your celebration, your blessing. That's where I kind of want the reading to go. But it's like this other situation may overshadow it. But again, you're a Gemini. You guys are pretty good about shutting that kind of stuff out. Uh, June twenty. No wait, June twenty first. Yeah, it has to do with your birthday. Your birthday month. So. Okay, one more, please. Trust. Trust that things are going to work out. Under the deck is action. So you guys actually have a really good reading. So celebrate. I'm going to talk to you guys later. Have a great week.